Hi, I'm Dr. Well with Pete's Happy Hearts. So you went to your doctor's office for sports physical for your child. Next thing you know, the child is not clear for sports and is being referred to a heart specialist known as a cardiologist. So what and why is the case and what should you expect at a cardiologist's office? So typically a child is not clear for sports if let's say the child is complaining of shortness of breath, chest pain with exercise, getting dizzy or passing out with exercise or saying, my heart feels funny, it's beating weird. Or if you're at the office and the doctor hears there's a heart murmur, there's a regularity, there's some concern, then the patient or child is referred to a cardiologist. At a cardiologist's office, when you walk in, most likely a cardiologist has ordered an electrocardiogram, also known as an EKG or ECG. So the test is not invasive, it does not hurt. Basically, stickers are, are placed on the arm, legs, and chest. And this study is to look at the heart electrical system. If there is some abnormality on the heart rate, rhythm, or interval, or there's any sign of thickness on heart, then there's further testing to be performed. Now we look at WPW, long QT syndrome, Brigada, any signs of heart thickness, and everything's on the EKG. If everything looks good, then that should be it. But if there's some concern, then ultrasound of the heart, also known as an echocardiogram, is performed. An echocardiogram is also a non-invasive test. It takes about 30 minutes to 60 minutes for the study to perform. It looks at the heart in real time. It looks at the chamber of the heart, the heart valve, any obstruction, how the heart's squeezing, looking at the corners itself to make sure everything's normal. If everything looks good, exam, tests, history is good, then the child can be cleared. If there's further abnormalities or there's concern, then further testing that can be performed could be a stress treadmill or a stress echocardiogram. These tests require the patient to be running on a treadmill to their, their peak performance or as much as they can um, while looking at their heart rhythm at that case. For a heart ultrasound or a stress echocardiogram, the kid will need to run really hard before they stop. And once they say, I can't continue, then the patient will stop. And then we'll look at the heart, how the heart's squeezing at that point in time. If that looks good, then the kid can be clear. Now, if there's further concern, then treatments may be performed. If there is some abnormality, it does not mean the child can't play sports. It's more of what do we need to do? Is there treatment? Is there prevention? What needs to be done to help the child play safely? So that's a little summary of what to expect at a cardiologist's office. If there's any comment or suggestion, please leave them below. If you have any questions or concerns, please feel free to reach me at pedeshappyhearts.com. And I look forward to seeing you guys all at next video.